Hi, this video tutorial I will cover generic interface and uh, generic class have uh, multiple type parameters. Here I have defined the generic interface pair using type parameters k and v. k meaning uh, key and v meaning value. It has uh, two methods get key and get value. Both are uh, abstract methods. Here I have defined the generic class uh, ordered per using type parameters k and v. Ordered per class implements per interface and uh, provide implementation of uh, get key and uh, get value method. And it has uh, ordered per uh, constructor which accept uh, key and value. Here I have defined the class uh, generic demo. It has main method. I am running this program in uh, debug mode. Here I have created uh, pair 1. In pair interface, I have specified key should be string and value should be integer. So in constructor of uh, ordered pair, I am passing uh, key as string and uh, value as uh, integer. Then I am calling uh, get key and uh, get value method of uh, pair 1 and here I got the output. Key is string and value is uh, integer. Here I have created pair 2. In pair interface uh, I have specified key should be string and value should be string. And uh, in ordered pair uh, constructor I am passing uh, key as string and value as uh, string. Then I am calling uh, get key method of uh, per 2 and get value method of per 2 and here I got the output. Here I have created name list object. In name list I am adding two names. Here I have created per 3. In per interface I have specified key should be string and value should be list. So in ordered per constructor, I am passing uh, key as string and uh, value as uh, list. Then I am calling uh, get key method of uh, per 3 and uh, get value method of uh, per 3. And uh, here I got the output. And uh, this is about uh, generic interface and generic class have multiple type parameters and thanks for watching.